Good morning, campers. Um, I hope you're having a great week. Uh, we're having a lot of fun posting all of these um, lovely oil tidbits for you guys this week. Uh, I wanted to hop on and talk to you today about lemon. So lemon is an oil that I use quite a bit. Um, I have to order it every couple of months because I go through the bottles um, because I use them all the time in my kitchen. Um, so that's mostly where I use my, my lemon. I use it um, to clean all of my uh, fruits and vegetables when I come home from the store or the market. So I fill my sink with cold water, about a cup of uh, white vinegar, and about five to seven drops of lemon. And then I soak my veggies and fruits in there for a few minutes before I rinse them off and put them away. It has made the biggest difference in um, cleaning my produce. You can see the gunk kind of floating on top of the water. So all the waxes and the residues that they spray, even on your organic produce, um, comes off into the water. Um, but it also has been keeping my produce fresher. So I've noticed that especially um, um, the organic stuff doesn't always last as long. So I've noticed that when I do soak it in the lemon water, it lasts a little bit longer, uh, which is great because you know you hate your stuff going bad in the fridge. The other thing I use it for in my kitchen is cleaning. Uh, it is fantastic for removing grease. So if you have um, the little film of, uh, of grease on top of your uh, stove hood, uh, even on your stove or your backsplash there, just a couple drops of lemon wipes that right off with a hot cloth. Um, I use it in my uh, uh, cleaning spray. So I'll make um, a spray with the doTERRA um, uh, do, uh, On Guard Cleaner Concentrate and I'll add a few drops of lemon. Uh, to that because it smells amazing mixed with on guard and it's great for cleaning your counters and your floors and things like that and it smells amazing so I often will diffuse it just by itself when I'm cleaning because the whole house will smell like lemon I also use it to clean my diffusers because when you know if you notice if you're uh, diffusing a lot of the uh, heavier oils like on on guard and things like that that have the spice in them you often get a residue in your diffuser so I will um, put vinegar in my diffusers and I'll turn them on but I really don't want my whole house to smell like vinegar so I'll put in a couple drops of lemon because it helps clean that sticky residue off and then it uh, decreases the the vinegar smell in your house some other great ways to use lemon is to get sticky off so we talked about grease but it's also great for removing stickers so if you're getting um, books or picture frames or things like that that the sticky residue doesn't come off from the sticker that's great but being a mom I find it so helpful when you need to get those stubborn band-aids off and um, they don't want to come off and they want to leave that black ring. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about if you have kids. So if you get the band-aid off with some lemon and you can just use a little bit more on a cotton ball and it brings that black sticky ring right off their skin. So it's another great way. And of course the most common way to use lemon is a drop in your water. So just make sure when you are putting lemon in your water you're using a glass container or stainless steel, not plastic. It will eat the plastic and it will release those chemicals that you really don't want to be drinking out of plastic anyway, but you'll get those chemicals into your water and you don't want that. But lemon is a fantastic oil. It is so uh, versatile, which is why I use it so much. And um, it smells amazing. There's like 45 lemons in a bottle of lemon oil. So it's very concentrated. So um, it's, it smells so fresh. So let us know below in the comments uh, what you use lemon for, um, what your favorite diffuser blends are with lemon, things like that. And have a great day. Bye.